You see along the New Haven Harbor a tank farm. The silos along the skyline are part of a project building the largest biodiesel plant in New England. And News 8's Aaron Cox tells us how what they produce could lower your grocery bill. This is the new tank farm at New Haven Terminal. No crops, no grass, but these silos part of a green project storing biodiesel fuel. We are ahead of the curve in New England. Greenleaf Biofuels building the largest conversion plant in New England, able to take used cooking oil, vegetable oil, animal fats, transforming it into 10 million gallons of biodiesel fuel a year. A less expensive option for tractor trailers, delivering food and other products to market, possibly meaning lower prices for us. And just about everything that uh, your viewers are buying from a store has come across the tailgate of a diesel vehicle. So diesel trucks are delivering most of the consumer goods that we buy locally. So it's very important that we consider the, the transportation cost. We are talking about blending fuels. So this building has a state of the art safety system. They will recirculate the air. There is a sprinkler system and also a sprinkler foam system that will go right out to the tank farm. The company building this plan, in part with some state funds, is expected to create 20 jobs for those with a chemistry background. It's a kind of, uh, of green, uh, energy efficient, environmentally sound, economic development initiative that we want to see more of in the city of New Haven and throughout the state of Connecticut. The goal is to have the plant up, running, and converting fuel by the fall. In New Haven, I'm Erin Cox, News 8.